most people think of football in Jacksonville and stadiums, they think of the Gator Bowl, better known today as Everbank Field, the home of the Jags. Matthews in the backfield, single back set. Will go ground. And Matthews is brought down. They're going to the hurry up offense and they're back to the line quickly. Now first and ten. Matthew. Good yardage picked up on that call. First down at the 45. Cunningham's taking off. Incomplete. The hit jarred the ball loose. Tyler. It's one of those guys. If he you knocks the ball, that ball. makes a mistake on the field, he doesn't make excuses. He knows no matter what the circumstances are, if you get your hands on the football as a receiver in the NFL, everybody expects you to make the catch. Coming up, second down. The Eagles lined up in the pistol. Ryan Matthews with the reception. And Matthews is taken down at the 46. Matthews in the backfield. Single back set. Third and one. Gets the handle here. Tackles made, and that'll move the chains. They're in the hurry-up mode. The Eagles take it from the 43. And they're all oh, over it. What do you about that? Second down here. Quarterback likes what he sees out there outside. He's changing the play with the wide receiver. Catch made. Brought down at the 26. We head to the fourth. Which of these defenses will crack first? We'll be back after this. We head to the fourth quarter. And these defenses have certainly shined. But they both know one little lapse. And it can cost your team the game. Yeah, it could. If you have a really a big-time middle breakdown, it would cost you the game. But I look at this, too, Jim. Low scoring. Here we go in the fourth quarter. I'm looking at whichever defense makes that big play to win the game. That, that's Chris Evans with the sack. Got to give the defense a lot of credit that time. The quarterback's trying to get rid of the football. He can't. They take him down for a sack with under two minutes to go here in the second half, and they're leading. The pass complete to Hartline. A critical moment in this game as it's third down. Always try to save the timeout or timeouts when you can. And one way to do it is go to the hurry up offense. Good job. The Eagles have it at the 24. A nice grab. No doubt he was going to hold on to that one. Well, the defense was trying to come up with the big stop there, but. The offense is able to keep the chains moving. Well, there's just no panic in the offense when you see what they've done so far here today, Jim. They kept their heads about them, and they just calmly executed that third down play. Now on first down, every step crucial the rest of the way. Takes the knee. I'll do this my way. We're just not moving the ball back.
the Eagles call for a timeout. They're in field goal range and should have a chance to win this game. Set now. The game on the line right here. He makes it, and the celebration is underway. What's it like for a team standing on the sideline waiting to see if the kicker can win the game for your team? Jim, it, it, it's very nerve-wracking to know that you have nothing to do with the outcome. It's all up to the kicker now. You've watched him make it many, many times in practice. When they do it, the game, that is, a, that is just exciting stuff. So for Bill Sims and all the crew at EA Sports,